when I try to educate people on how to use harnesses or in my orientation, I talk about, um, I try to touch on things that other superintendents don't touch on during the orientation because a lot of these people who come to the Hoffman job sites have been to a dozen others in their career. And so I try to hold their attention by talking about something maybe they haven't heard about. And one of the things I do talk about is the straps that are on the side of a lot of harnesses over your hip area. If you do fall, uh, you sit in that harness until somebody retrieves you. If you're in an area or somebody doesn't have a plan, doesn't know how to retrieve you, you could be sitting there for a while. It's going to take a, the fire department, if you're 200 feet off the ground, they have to be called, they have to arrive. You're going to wait there until they figure out how to reach you. You have minutes sitting in a harness while you're dangling there and all the pressures on the inside of your thighs on that femoral artery until you are start to develop a clot. And so developing a clot there is going to depend on if you have a blood disease, how healthy you are, um, you know, how much trauma you had when you fell. And so those straps right there are extremely important. I tell everybody that you, if you're going to be wearing a harness, you want those straps there. Because if you aren't deploying those straps and you understand how to deploy it, hook it together and stand in there, you're going to sit there and you're going to get a clot. Now, the clot isn't the problem. The problem is when you get taken out of that harness and that clot gets let go out of that femoral artery and where it travels to. Because if it travels to your lungs, it can cause a pulmonary embolism, or if it goes to your brain, it can cause a stroke, okay? And so it's extremely important. If people think just putting on a harness and tying off correctly is all they need to know, they're only halfway there. And falling in a harness is bad. Falling in a harness and having a stroke and having paralysis on the side of your body and losing your speech and changing your whole life that's a big deal.